In our second example, we're going to use uh, C as our point one. And we will use D as point two. And again, we'll use the distance formula <coughs> where uh, the distance from C to D is equal to the square root of x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. <coughs> C, you notice, has the coordinates negative 4, comma 2. So that's going to be our x1 and y1. D has the coordinates of negative 1, negative 2. So we're going to let that take the place of x2, y2. Now we're simply going to replace the x's and y's with the particular numbers. So the distance from c to d, again, is the square root. x2 is negative 1 minus x1 is negative 4, so that's minus 4 squared plus y2 is negative 2 minus and y1 is 2 squared. Now we go back to our algebra and usage of integers. We know that two negatives right here make a positive. So now this becomes negative 1 plus 4 squared plus negative 2 minus 2 is negative 4 squared. Continuing on, the distance from C to D again is the square root. Negative, four, negative 1 plus 4 is 3. So we have 3 squared plus negative 4 squared. If we square both of those, C to D distance is, again, the square root. 3 times 3 is 9. Negative 4 times negative 4 is a positive 16. If we add 9 and 16 together, we get 25. And the square root of 25 is 5. So the distance from C to D is 5 units.